Hey everyone, PR7 here, and in this video, I'll tell you how to install uh, Android 5.1.1 Lollipop or any other ROM on your Samsung Galaxy S2, or same steps for all the devices. So let's get started. First, we need to hold the power key, volume up, and home key all at once till the time we till you have to keep on pressing it till the time we reach the recovery mode. One more flash and it might appear this time okay so when you come to the recovery mode let me just focus my camera wipe that data slash factory reset go ahead and click that use your uh, use your volume rocker to navigate and power button to select yes this one it will say it is just wiping data and cache for flashing lollipop rom you have to have the lollipop kernel in flashed on it i have a video on how to flash custom kernels you can check that out now we have to now to select wipe cache partition and same process hit on yes your recovery mode might look a different might look different but the steps are same for all the features now let's go to advanced wipe dalbic cache this won't take much time ok this is done now mounts and storage i think my i think you think my power button whatever format system yes format and let's wait for it to get format now the last step for this wiping data format preload what these steps basically does is remove all the remains of your previous rom or the stock rom whichever rom you must be having now hit on install zip you can see it over here now select the destination i have it is my sd card so it's sd card 1 and for internal sd card it's sd card 0 where you have downloaded and kept the rom now my one is research and remix lollipop and I'm back it took about four to five minutes it might vary for you now let me flash the G app package that is a Google app by this you will get the Play Store and other apps if you don't do this step you won't get the apps like Play Store, Play Games, Play Music and also other basic features of Google Play Store like Play Services the main feature or if you are using this then only flash it if you don't use Google apps then there is no need but for Play Store you have to do this it's a compulsory Okay, so it's done. Now you can pretty much reboot your system. So reboot system now. The first option, if you can't see, I'm just bring it a little close. Whatever. Okay. Okay, if you see this kind of thing, then yes, fix me. This happens because probably some many a times the root access is lost while flashing a new ROM. So this step will fix the root access that means it won't have any issues for root you can just get rid hmm the boot animation was nice that will take again some time i'll be back
okay so it again took about two to four minutes and now i'll leave it again the optimizing app will take place 9 12 13 out of 85 update is in progress so again i'll fast forward this part I think it's about it okay so select your language English United States of course I think okay so insert sim card I think I have inserted the sim is there although okay so there's the Wi-Fi country even scan for a Wi-Fi signal Okay, so here's the Wi-Fi network. Let me just quickly connect it. Software update this time. Just checking for updates. Downloading Google Play Store. <clears throat> I'll, this time I'll just slowly password because it's a quite long process. Okay, so this is basically it and I am in my home screen and finally I have installed, I mean I have flashed this ROM. So thanks for watching, if this video helps you, then please like and please subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for the next video that will be the, the review of this ROM which I will be doing. So thanks for watching, please subscribe, like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Google+, Plus. Hasta la vista.